First Territorial Cup game of the year, non-conference though, was a nice night for Arizona State. Although Arizona did its best to make it nerve-wracking in the ninth inning. Wildcats put on a late rally, and Arizona State hangs on 7-5. to five. And Scott Erickson, Jordan Aboites, really showed something with his his presence on the mound. Yeah, five foot six, but the heart of a Wolverine out there tonight. He really attacked that Arizona lineup, came right after him, and then did a great job of backdooring some sliders early on. Got a few strikeouts and took control of the game. And ASU, which had been scuffling on defense, was beautiful tonight. That was the play of the night by David Greer at third. Yeah, great play right there. Gets you out at first base. Could have been a double down the line. All night long, Arizona made the plays. Arizona State came up with some good defensive job right there. And turn and two, shut down any Wildcat rallies. And it was Arizona that had infield mistakes that cost them. And then the biggest hit of the night was Colby Woodmansey's two out, two run single in the second. Yeah, good piece of hitting right there. That's the one thing Arizona couldn't do tonight was come up with a clutch base hit to drive a couple runs in. Arizona State did a good job of getting runners across the board. A couple defensive miscues by the Wildcats and a couple walks. And then a big fly right there. We saw a lot of hard hit balls tonight, but that one was crushed. Yeah. We saw about five or six that had a chance, but David Greer in the sixth inning hit his third of the year, the only ball that got out tonight. Again, Arizona scored a run in the eighth, two in the ninth, had the tying run at the plate for the final out. But ASU holds on to win it. Seven to five, the first of five meetings between the Sun Devils and the Wildcats this year. This weekend, Arizona home for Stanford, ASU home for Cal.